So that was 15 years ago. I know, it took this long to get me back. Yeah, Anna. I'm so sorry. I had to get third on AGT to have me back. I, I was going to have you back no matter what. I mean, I've been watching you. You're hilarious. And thanks for the T-shirt. You gave me one of those. You're welcome. My Thank pleasure. You. Thanks so much. What has, you have kids now? A lot's happened in 15 years. It is insane. I have two kids, teenagers, as you know. The, uh, that's a lot to deal with, uh, a lot of emotions. Uh, hey, don't owe me, buddy. <laughs> I'm just trying to deal with these kids with one hand. That's my problem. <laughs> and so, and they must have been supportive for, to do AGT, right? Um, you know, they're uh, very supportive. I was uh, surprised when I, I came home, my son actually like teared up and he said, you did amazing. My daughter didn't really care at all. <laughs> so, That's uh, sweet that he's sensitive. He's a sensitive one. Yeah. yeah. It's, and it's, uh, well, you know, I won last comic stand and that was the last time I was on here. And uh, that's against comedians. That's like apples to oranges. AGT is like apples to carburetors or something. Yeah. Very different. You're up against so many different kinds of people. But you came in third. Yes. Yeah, that's fantastic. Uh, thank, I you. Mean, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, I, will, I will say I, I, uh, I lost to a magician, and I apologize to the comedy community. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Ellen. He's pretty good. He's good. Yeah. All right, so you're going to perform for us, right? Uh, yeah. The, the, yeah. Not, you want me to do You that? were the first uh, stand-up that I had on my show 15 years ago. Nobody had, had done it before. That was awesome. Uh, yeah, okay, good, because I've been putting that on my resume. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, it's accurate. All right, you're going to do some stand-up. All right, let me All do right. this. All right, Josh Blue, everybody. Uh -oh. All right. So uh, I like to mention I have cerebral palsy. I like to get that out of the way early. Uh, otherwise, the audience is like, does he know that he has that? <laughs> yes, I I'm aware. Uh, my jokes are about a guy with cerebral palsy. This is all I've ever known. Comes from this perspective. To tell the truth, early in my career, I tried to do my show from a Southern Belle point of view. <laughs> I just never played quite right. <laughs> Dear diary. <laughs> you know, I used to think I had a way with animals. And then I realized I just make a lot of crumbs. <laughs> just got a pack of random dogs following me around, just hoping I'll break into a muffin or something. I don't know how many times I've tried to go into a restaurant and they're like, you can't bring your dogs in here. I'm like, these are my dogs. <laughs> then I just come to find out they're other people's service dogs. They just saw me on the street like, hey man, you wait here, I gotta help this guy. <laughs> Speaking of helping people, I've always enjoyed helping folks. But what I've learned is that since I've been able to grow a beard, strangers will not accept my kindness. Yeah, let's just say you get your car stuck in a ditch, and then I just happen to be the first one on the scene, <laughs> just lumbering toward your vehicle, like, hey, I'm here to help. <laughs> You've already been through a traumatic experience. <laughs> now you got yourself locked in your car, <laughs> trying to get rid of me through a crack, and I went, I'm fine. <laughs> no, please just go on by. No, I wanted to be here, please, please. Also, I just had this happen to me again. I was in New York City and I tried to hail a taxi and I caught a pigeon. <laughs> hey, you guys are awesome, thank you so much. Go to my website. You can also register to audition for the next season of AGT, auditions.com. The AGT Las Vegas live stage show opens November 4th at Luxor. We'll be right back. Josh Blue, everybody. Thank you so much.